ever. I've gotten to silver once, and it was a very shocking thing when I got to silver. I'm like, this elo exists? Silver exists? I'm like looking around. Like, what? After four years, I discover that silver exists? No, I didn't get to gold or platinum. I have yet to visit those elos. Well, here's the thing. Isn't Susan not even supposed to work in gold and platinum? Oh. Hmm. Well, Vager could have been a good pick this game. I just didn't know who I was against. I usually use Annie as a blind pick, and then I have Vager. Vager, Vager is actually more practical than Nasus in some areas, because if you're in like a team and they don't punish your Nasus, I mean your Vager from a distance, if they can't punish him, the Vager suddenly becomes a god. Like, that's what happened. Well, like, even though we were behind early game really hard, they didn't end the game quick enough, and I had Vager, and they lost. Like, they lost Stone Cold. Even though they had a legendary Kaisa, they lost because they, 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 they it was a ABAM, and they don't, didn't hit the Nexus. I'm like, if you don't hit the Nexus, and I'm playing Viger, you're done. You're actually done. Because... Like, I'll just nuke you. Well, no, Viger, as long as he has enough time, you're screwed. That's the thing that's that's creepy about Viger. Because he can build Bruiser, he can, like, a Nasus can. Like, he could build Nasus's build and kill Nasus with it. Like, I'm not making this up. Give Viger the time and he will kill a Nasus. That's how creepy Viger is. I know, I'm just saying, but most of the time, I'm actually able to control Nasus with Viger. Like, when I pick him. Granted, when I pick him. Not just the cage, the damage. The damage increases. They don't see the damage until it's too late. They're like, nah, I can take him, and then they die, and they're like, what is this damage? It's like, yeah, that that's... I, I told you... If you don't end the game, the Vager will kill you. What do you mean the Vager will kill you? No, the Vager will... The the things that counter Vager, by the way, most of them are early game. There is an exception. You know what the exception is? I really hate to admit it. Vladimir. And, a, and somewhat Cassidy, but mostly right now it's Vladimir. Because Vladimir... He can soak damage better than Anasis because what he does is he's like, okay, you do damage, right? But you also have health. I'm going to take the health from you. And it's like, fun. And you'll pull, you'll pull my cage, soak the, and you have a better early game than most late game champions. And you scale late. It's like, fun. Nice. This this Garen is messing up because he see the Garen only has one window. He's not like a Viger. He only has one window to punish Anasis. And if he misses that window, he's done. Why does he have level 5 already? Uh, I can't one-shot over Khan yet. Not- the keywords is yet. I know, but he's obnoxious. Like, he's like Nunu mid or some shit. He's not to be taken lightly. 
Like, yes, Viger outscales him, but I'm not playing Viger right in this second. Well, you can, you can main Viger in a number of areas you wouldn't think you'd be able to. He, he does have weaknesses, though. Like, he's not, it's not free to play him because his early game is kind of shitty and he can get dove early, but if he gets past that, good luck. Good luck with that. You're, you're in danger. Yeah, that's, that's kind of how Viger works. If you did not punish him early game, good luck with that. Because, like, that, that legendary Kaisa and the Jin and everyone was like, oh my god, why are we losing now? And like, like, later on when they didn't kill the Nexus, it's like, you didn't kill the Nexus before I got 1,000 AP. Once, once I hit that 1,000 plus AP, things are going to get start to get really nasty. Things that looked previously invincible are now just going to die in, like... Um, I'm just, I'm trying to get my items. You see, the thing it, it's weird about League of uh, Avion sometimes is sometimes in Avion, I just wish there was something like Grievous Wounds like easily available because <laughs> in Avion 2 especially, there's so many healers. It's just like, oh my god, there's another healer. <laughs> Get the healer out of my... It's an obscure video game. It's an RPG, but Grievous Wounds would be so useful in that game. Because, like, the rogue mages, like, have healing constantly. And it's really annoying. It's like, oh, yeah, I did some damage to them. They healed for more than the sum of all of my damage. And it's just, like, fun. So much fun. <laughs> Can't we get some Grievous Wounds for that? Can they sell me an item in the shop or a spell? Call Grievous Wounds? Or, uh, 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 like, uh, can they sell me like a, a, a sword called Executioner's Calling or something? Buy Executioner's Calling. It's 800 gold. Even though that would be expensive in that game. Just, just buy it. <laughs> You're finally able to take on that healer and stop them from healing for more than the sum of all the damage you deal to them. I don't. At this point, I want him to because I'm sick of Garen's winning lane. The uh, only problem is um, bot lane is... um, Yeah. Um, Rakan's roaming up, I think. Okay, you know what? I'm coming up there. I'm going to see if I can get a clean. Is he low? I just want to... Um, I need to clear this ward out. No, he's kind of low. Um... I'm trying to get away from the dude. Can you like? All 
There we go. Well, I'm trying to get him off me because he, he did some shit. All right. I didn't want him to go back on me. He's going full AP. I'm gonna all. Uh, is it okay that we all uh, roam bot lane and um, gang bang the uh, Ezreal? Well, I mean later on. Later on, after we, like, finish lane phase, can we, like, go down and, like, gangbang him? Well, I'm just saying, if we gangbang Ezreal, we'll get a lot of gold. I'm coming up. Tibbers in three. Tibbers in three. Okay, at least you're getting involved. I like it. Because I thought you were going to be a little too passive, so that's what I was worried about. Thankfully, that's not the concern. Because, see, a lot of Nasus players, no offense to you, but they're, they're excessively passive, you know? Like, they don't, they don't take advantages that they have. It's fine. It's fine. The fact that you're active is good. Yeah, I know. I'm just saying. The fact that you're active as a Nasus, it means you're one of the better Nasus players. Because the, 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 the tr one of the things that like, the newer Nasuses do is they don't try to do something when they... Um, Now Leona's coming to my lane. Like, what? Huh. I need my damn mythic. That's why I'm staying even. I mean, I, I, I kind of respect it because um, aggressive, aggressive Nasuses are the better Nasuses. The, the, passive, the passive ones are not as good. Oh my god, bot lane! You, oh my god! Hang on. I, I gotta get my Mythic. So, okay, I've got Tibbers. I've got Tibbers. I'm running bot. I'm, I'm, I've got Tibbers. I'm running bot. Hang on. Hang on. Don't. Oh, uh, I'm on. <clears throat> okay, are they low enough? Is he low? He's not low. God damn it. I wanted him to be low. Shit. Can I go get my Mythic now? Because I need my Mythic. Mythic is going to give me real power. Because I, I need to one-shot people. I need to get this Tibbers in this Ezreal's face when he's low and, and, and blow him up. Yeah, I tried to get a Rome bot, but I didn't want to engage the Ezreal because he was near full. Um, feeding like crazy. What else do you think they're doing? Uh, Rakan's roaming top. 
Ow! What? They're probably dead inside. Um, you want to help me with Rakan? He's trying to jump in my face now. I'm on my way. Our bot lane is basically Omega trolling. She's tanky as shit. Alright. My Tibbers is soon going to die, but he's going to respawn in 30 seconds. I mean, I would power farm, but I'm in a grave situation, as you can clearly see with what bot lane did. I need a ward. I need to keep vision up. I'm not just going to wait because I need to, to take action. You mean the Rakan. Because I would go for the Rakan. He pisses me off. The, he's got a winning bot lane. That You know, that's honestly what is pissing me off the most about the enemy team, is that they have a bot lane that isn't straight trolling. Because I swear, my win rate has taken such a happy hit from these bot lines. Uh, mute. What the fuck? I have no mana. Run for my life. I can't get out. I have no mana. I don't know, but I'm not going to die for it randomly. I this the this elo is shit. That's that that's all you really need to know. <sighs>
Just report them, please. I'm I'm annoyed. Who? Me or the bot? Yeah, just report the noobs, please. The bloody bot lane! Our bot lane is beyond stupid! Our bot lane's like iron four shit. It's because our bot lane just griefed. Like, I don't even know what to do here, necessarily, because they just... <sighs> they did too much damage. I said yes because you guys snowballed this shit too hard. I don't know what to do. Not it's not you. It's not you, Nasus. I'm honoring you. It's the rest of the shitheads. Especially this bot lane. Holy fuck. Like this bot lane. <sighs> Give me a headache. Oh my god. So goddamn annoying. Ever we had for a bot lane. 